Hello ladies and gentlemen, it's Mike here at Game From Scratch, and today I have not one, not two, but like five game dev bundles for you running on Humble right now. Two new ones uh, that I'm going to bring to your attention, and then some smaller ones I didn't cover that I decided I'm going to merge together into these kind of summary videos. So if you're looking for game dev assets, Humble has you covered right now. We're going to start things off with the Open World Adventure Kit. Now this one is from Decagon. Uh, these are redeemed on the Fab Marketplace, key by key by key, which is a little bit annoying for sure. Now you're going to notice something with the way these tiers work. You've got actually, instead of the $1 in the median tier, you actually have a $5 tier, a $15 tier, and a $25 tier if my conversions to USD is working right. Uh, and that's kind of a nice approach. What you're going to find with the Decagon stuff is it's real world assets. So let's go take a look at one of these in action. So this is uh, the subway train. To get an idea of what their assets look like, this is one of the environments. Um, nice stuff. Again, the nice thing is since it is... Uh, an Unreal Engine project. Unreal Engine is the best game engine for getting your stuff out and running uh, on other engines. And this is totally authentic because people have even left their subway ticket litters <laughs> around the environment. So it gives you an idea of what this is like. Again, one of the nice things with the Decagon stuff is that it's entirely the same art style for this. So uh, it's a real world style at the $1, or sorry, at the $5 tier here, you're going to see, for example, you're getting doors and street signs. And um, we got a couple of environments like a quarantine tent. Another thing I want to point out, though, we've definitely had a lot of this in previous bundles. So make sure that you don't already own what you might be interested in, because, again, we have had a lot of these in the past. But you're seeing here just a ton of like real world props in a real world art style. So that is uh, generally useful, and it doesn't look like asset flips if you use it either. In your own game as long as your game uses a real world art style so we moved up to the median tier here at 15 bucks you can see here another environment again for sure we've had this in previous this one for sure this one i don't think so so some of this is new some of this is repeats uh but you see here a number of different environments and then other than that a bunch of like shrubs and props and so on just the kind of things that you need to populate your world so that, that is genuinely useful we've got a couple of car packs here as well and then we go back up here to the very top and we got the full fat so you're getting 87 items here 87 different packs for 25 bucks again all on the fab marketplace for unreal engine uh, but there are guides down below for exporting them out to say Godot or unity or whatever if you're willing to go through the work so here you see you've got subways well covered tunnels trains and terminals there this is the one that we saw in action just a second ago so this is the subway train gives you an idea of what their stuff looks like and then we got a bunch of like foliage packs um and then more props a bunch more environments here again this is a repeat this one I think is not. So you're going to want to check out, make sure you don't already own what you might be interested in. But the nice thing is since these are all individual fab keys, uh, you can give away uh, to someone else if you've already got a duplicate. So good value for 25 bucks for sure. Uh, especially again, if you are using like a real world art style, that is the open world adventure kit from Decagon. Next up, we have a new audio pack. And in these ones, I love this is from Ovani. They're probably my favorite provider of game audio on Humble. Uh, it's a hell of a deal. You're looking at 20 bucks for 32 items here. It's a combination of sound effects packs. By the way, you can hear a preview of them right here if you want. I don't like playing audio uh, on YouTube just because of the bizarro content ID laws around YouTube. Uh, but you're going to notice here, uh, it is 20 bucks. By the way, they're licensed. They do register the content ID for you, so you are safe to use these in YouTube. I just I never trust YouTube when it comes to music. Joe, uh, one of those things to be aware of, but their license does allow you to do it. I'm just being paranoid. So you see here, 32 items there for 20 bucks, uh, or you got the $1 tier here where you're getting an impressive uh, six items there, uh, music packs and sound effects packs. So this is nice. So if you need like uh, sounds from Wild West or sports and so on, the nice thing, Avani tends to make it so that each one of these bundles is new stuff, except for one aspect of that, and that is the plugins. So you're going to notice here, we've got a variety of plugins. All right, so they're in the bottom of the full tier. So at the $20 tier, if you scroll to the very bottom, you'll notice you have a Godot, a Unity, and an Unreal Engine music plugin. Why do you need these? Well, you don't technically need them, but what you're going to find is, so sound effect packs are straightforward. It's literally just folly effects, sound effect packs for a variety of themes. So if you need handgun sounds, whatever, you've got you covered. But for the music stuff, so say like hyper action right here, the music will actually be available in multiple different intensities. And then what you can do is use the plugin and scale between them inside of your game. So if in your game, you've got a, you know, an action scene that's ramped up, you can 
kind of pull up a slider and make the sound tracks more dynamic. It's really one of the cool things that Ovani does with their sound effects. So if you are looking to add to your sound effects library, uh, the Ovani stuff, you can never go wrong with it. You really can't. I love their stuff. And for 20 bucks, it is one hell of a deal. And again, the only repeats tends to be these plugins. Uh, and these plugins, again, are optional, but they enable you to have dynamic soundtracks in your game, which is very cool. And then on the audio side of things, we also have this launch uh, earlier in the week, I think it was, the Ultimate Sound Effects and VFX bundle. Uh, so this one is... Um, from Lurtez, who we normally see for graphic stuff. Uh, and it's also cheap. So I think we're looking at like 15 bucks here for the 29 items. And again, you got some sound effects, here, explosions, and I don't know how you make the sound of dust. <laughs> I don't know what dust sounds like. Maybe dust sounds kind of like, but I don't know. So you can see here a number of different sound effects packs um, for different things. So if you're looking for uh, to build up your sound effects library, uh, could be a good pick up for you there. Uh, again, I know them more for their um, uh, graphic side of things. Uh, they have a number of bundles normally for really good graphical stuff. I don't really know them quite as much for the sound effects stuff. But once again, if you want to check it out, each one of these does have a preview. Oh, no, no preview there. Well, that's disappointing. Huh. Okay. That's uh, different to the norm. Uh, so anyways, that is the ultimate sound effects and VFX bundle. And then we have Opus Effects. Now this is nothing to do with sound effects for a game. So we got two really cool audio sound effects packs bundles, but then we've also got the Opus Effects. And this one is actually about creating things. So this is a bunch of plugins, VSTs, etc., for your, um, your music creation software. So maybe something like Reaper or whatever. Uh, generally these are available as VSTs you could plug in they're they're universal so they'll work with whatever tool as long as it supports that interface and you should see a number of different um, tools or sequencers or so on this is really one of those areas that I do I, I'm rather incompetent about music if you've heard me in the past make some you'll understand what I'm talking about and then we've got a couple of sound effects packs in here as well uh, but mostly this is uh, tools etc for your audio uh, creation. Uh, and then this one is a bit of, uh, I mentioned this, I think it was last weekend, but worth mentioning again, uh, we have the uh, Unreal Engine Asset Mega Bundle already going on here. Now this one is from new creators. So we got Barrel Bark in there, uh, Painter uh, There's one other creator in here as well, uh, but not someone that we generally see in action. So, oh, Tenor. So we got a uh, Another Unreal Engine asset pack going on over at Humble as well. So if you're looking to stock up on Humble content, uh, they definitely got you covered. And then there's also this one, and it's not selling that well, which I actually find a little disappointing because I love to see Defold having these training courses available out there. Uh, this is the Defold course bundle. This is from Zenva. Uh, so there's five books on, or five, sorry, video courses on Defold. The nice thing is they also have PDFs to go along with these things. So they do come with books as well. And then some more just generalized game development. So this one has been running for a little bit. It's not going to be on for much longer. Uh, but this, if you are interested in learning Zenva, sorry, yeah, learning to fold, uh, this bundle is going on as well. But the big new ones for sure were the first two I talked about. And then finally, we have the Moho Pro 12. Now this one is, uh, this is delusional. It's, it's nowhere near that price, but it is a cheaper way to buy Moho. So if you're looking to pick up Moho uh, 12, I think it's 12 and a half that you'll be getting here. Um, and then you can actually upgrade to the newest version for cheaper by using this version as well. Uh, or you can pick it up again, uh, what is that, like 25 bucks? here for this 2d animation package moho is available all the time on humble though so just want to think aware of this this has happened a couple of times before and it will no help no doubt happen again but if you're looking to pick it up probably the cheapest way to go about it but the stars of the show today in my opinion are the open world adventure kit once again here is a sample of what their assets look like and they look like well real life uh and then we have the other one going on over here, which is the Ovani Audio Odyssey Volume 2, a great collection of game-ready sound effects and music, and then some plugins to make dynamic music soundtracks in your Unreal Unity or Godot game a possibility. So let me know what you think of these bundles. Also, do you appreciate having them all bundled together like this, or would you rather have me do individual videos like I used to? Let me know. Comments down below. I will talk to you all later. Goodbye.